get after it. like someone forgot to uh, close the hatch before they went to bed. Did you get a little wave action? <laughs> We just put a reef in the mainsail. We pulled in some of the jib. It's a little rougher than we thought it was gonna be this morning. A couple foot swells. Uh, we've had uh, plenty of uh, crashing waves over the bow. We're a little salt, even some water in the cockpit. So we just kind of brought in a little bit of the sail just to kind of keep us from uh, getting so wet a little more upright. But other than that, uh, it's a pretty fun sail right now and uh, we're making good time. So the wind died down a couple hours ago. Uh, we've been motoring and uh, it's really hot outside. So we're in the middle of the lake uh, and I am going to jump in real quick and get a nice refreshing dip. One, two, three. Woo. How is it? It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Dinner one in the books. Nothing like some Chef Boyardee ravioli. It's crazy, Molly and I were just talking. This morning when we left Sheboygan, it was uh, pretty good sailing, but then turned into four to six foot swells, pretty high winds, we were reefing, uh, and then later in the day it turns into no wind at all, totally dead, swimming in the middle of the lake, and now we're having a nice little wind at our back, fair winds following seas, and we're gonna be sailing through the night hopefully just like this. Just amazing how this lake can 
change just like that and over the course even just 12 hours just go from kind of crazy to nothing to just an absolutely beautiful sale. I'm loving it right now. I wish I could take a picture or good video of the sky right now because this is definitely the most stars I have ever seen in my life. The amount of satellites and uh, shooting stars is just crazy. I've never seen anything like this. It's beautiful. Hey, look, a dolphin. <laughs> what about shark? <laughs> 